Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm in the process of making wigs and I wanted to show a quick tutorial showing how I bleach the knots on a lace frontal. So the frontal that I'm going to be using comes from my hair company, Sugar Plum's Hair Collection. If you are in need of any good quality frontals, closures, and bundles, please check out the link below. So the first thing you want to do is push back any stray hairs that may be in a way. This will avoid getting bleach on the hair. So the type of bleach and developer that I used is the Clairol Professional and I use the Collado Colors in blue and I also use the 40 volume developer. To get seamless results, I recommend using a plastic knife to mix the bleach in the developer and to apply the bleach onto the lace. Make sure that your bleach is not too watery. If you have to, go back and add more powder into the mix, but it is best to have a thick consistency of bleach and this will help the bleach not seep into the lace onto the hair. So this is how your bleach should look. You want to make sure that it's nice and pasty. So now we're going to move on to the next step, which is applying it to the lace. So this step is very simple. You want to make sure that you're using a really light hand. Make sure that you're not pressing down on the bleach too harshly. And you're just spreading the bleach out like butter. So this is how your final result should look. The bleach should be spreaded all over the lace, not missing a spot. And then you wanna lay the lace face forward on whatever you're using to bleach on top of, whether it's aluminum foil or a plastic bag. And I just wanted to show you guys this part to let you guys know that the bleach did not get on the hair at all. So that's what I mean by applying a thick consistency of bleach. If it was too watery, it would have went all up into the hair. So I let the bleach sit on the lace for about 10 minutes and then I went in with my Isoplus Neutralizing Shampoo and my Shimmer Lights Shampooing Conditioner. So this is what the final results look like. I let the shimmer light sit on the hair for about 10 minutes and this kind of took away the brassiness that was left into the hair after I bleached it. So 
So I'm not quite done yet. I go back in with my homemade lace scent that I will be releasing soon for purchase. And I let that sit on the lace for about a good five minutes. So this is the final, final results. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I had so much fun recording and doing this for you. Comment below. Let me know what you guys would like to see from me. I actually got this video idea from a subscriber who left the comment in my last video. So again, I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Talk to you later.